here with Years and Years and Brad. <laughs> and it's this day in Disney for December 1st. Oh boy, you know what that means. Snow for a lot of people. Well, there's 25, 25 days, days away, to Christmas. 25 days of Christmas. <laughs> That's right. I'm sorry. I'm just like, I've been in Christmas for two weeks solid. <laughs> Yeah, well, keep Love enjoying it. it. There's more to cheer, come. Cheer, 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 cheer is here. We need to be drinking eggnog. Yes. Yeah. Well, we did have a little bit at the beginning. The almond Right. Milk, and we have been mm -hmm. having hot cocoa. We oh, even had a frozen, frozen hot, hot cocoa, cocoa okay. at the ABC commissary. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you things? can get those frozen hot cocos all over Hollywood Studios. Was not so, I, you'll probably be having more, I'm guessing. Yeah. They have a nice wide straw on it, which I'll just mm -hmm. say quickly. The cardboard straws might perform better if they were wider. <laughs> He's just going to put that out there. Yeah, so. it's awesome. Any bitty making straws, make them wider. Yeah, yep, the, yep. the cardboard. Yeah. Right. yeah. I mean, you have to be prepared. <laughs> yeah. Which brings true. us to... <laughs> we're going to, for this day in Disney, 1966 with the release of a very cool film, Follow Me Boys. So, About? Yes. The Boy Scouts. The Boy Scouts. That's why I said be prepared. Are always prepared. That's the same way. Yep. That's the motto. <laughs> That's their motto. So this was released at theaters on this day, December 1st in 1966. That was kind of interesting that it was out. Yeah, a Christmas um, movie. Yeah, kind of Christmas. Winter vacation. Yeah. Um, so it's starring some big names, Fred McMurray. <laughs> the and... biggest, which, I mean, really, yeah. Fred McMurray, mm -hmm. such a Disney legend, such a personality and face of Disney yes. for many of the early live action films. Right. And in some ways to me, like a hand selected embodiment of an actor that portrays things the way Walt might if he were to appear in front of the camera. I think he really loved Fred McMurray. Yeah, I think that they were similar mm -hmm. people, so it's kind of neat. Yeah. Because um, I think we kind of talked about that in the Did the it? Shaggy Dog. Perhaps. Do you remember when we talked about that? I don't think that? I was in that one. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, oh yeah, true. Uh, maybe we, yeah. <laughs> meaning we. Yes. Us guys, we talked about it. And then also, um, wasn't he the absent minded? Of pastor? course. Yes. Yeah. So, yes. there you go. Um, so also Kurt Russell was in his film. Mm. So he was in a lot of Disney films. He was actually gonna be in, uh, I think it was eight films over 10 years. Mm -hmm. Which he's still yeah. making though. I mean, he was in Tron. There you go. So he's yeah. still living up there. And he's, a, he's in Guardians. In Guardians. Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. Oof, that was some yeah. role <laughs> in Guardians. Okay. A little so. ego or galactic size ego. Exactly. <laughs> so this film though, Follow Me Boys, um, featured the Boy Scouts of America. Mm -hmm. The title song, Follow Me Boys, was written by um, Robert and Richard Sherman. And it's, you know, totally one of their songs that's memorable. It's in my head right now. And, um, you know, when you watch the film, you'll see it's mm -hmm. definitely a right Sherman. Right from the beginning. It opens with the yeah, credits. Sherman Brothers. <laughs> catchy song, yes. you know? And then also the Boy Scouts had considered this to, you know, use this song as their anthem. Had they? They did, but huh. um, efforts for this were eventually dropped. Well, maybe they like sang yeah. it at jamborees and stuff, yeah. like, something like that. I actually am a Boy Scout. He's a Boy Scout. You know, he's grew a, up in the 80s. An Eagle Scout. I am an Eagle Scout, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Even uh, was a Cub Scout. And uh, some of my yeah. early grade school pictures even bear the Cub Scout uniform. But yeah, did uh, Boy Scouts all the way through. And your dad to the Eagle. too. And your my dad. My father is pretty He's, is a lifelong. Yeah. Uh, he still amazing. works with um, special needs. He's a like council level, like multi council level special needs uh, coordinator for the Boy Scouts of America. But what did he get? He's gotten the highest. One, right? Yes, I believe he even has a silver beaver. Yeah, yeah. he uh, very, so cool. very, very mm -hmm. accomplished, um, wonderful, wonderful man. So, yeah, we're very proud of him. Yeah, <laughs> but I mean, to this day, you know, uh, a scout is trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. I mean, <laughs> there you go. That's what it's all He's about. A good scout. 
That's he right. was a good scout, and I was a scout master. You? Oh my gosh, for two she years. was no. Yep. <laughs> she was a cub master, yep. and one of the finest I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> the boys really enjoyed her. We very went much. fishing. We built Indeed. pine by, uh, pine wood derby cars. We had mm -hmm. lots of fun. And she was wonderful. We had some fun, and our son Madison was a cub Isn't scout. Isn't he a scout as well? Well, he was a cub scout at the mm -hmm. time, so mm -hmm. we had a lot of fun with that. It Indeed. was a good time. So we love this film. Yeah, um, this film, of course. Yeah, I mean, this film really embodies attributes of Walt and his Americana. Mm -hmm. And I mean, yeah. not so much, this is not nationalism. This is a service organization of adventuring boys. Yeah. And they are led by a man of character, you know. And Boy Scouts of America, it's about character counts, you know. Mm -hmm. And I don't know that, you know, we know what the Boy Scouts of America will become or what it is or what it is now. It's kind of in a lull right now and maybe things are happening. I think the whole thing should happen through an app and be open to everyone. Like just, you want to participate in the Boy Scouts of America? Install the app, maybe even pay a little bit of dues. Yeah. The pandemic and stuff like that. No, I'm talking about hard. entirely. Oh, okay. Entirely, <laughs> like an app. Well, apps are pretty successful. <laughs> yeah, I think kids would do it. Yeah. They would just, they would enjoy doing the requirements and the, the ranks and all those things. the requirements being in an app is yeah. highly necessary. Yeah. If it's not already I'm just saying sure that I'm not, not sure. <laughs> I'm not, yeah, all I'm saying is I'm not sure that we need the patrols and the mm -hmm. troops and the functioning in that way. That it can actually be an independent activity. They have like the Lone Scout program mm -hmm. and run it with requirements and some sort of recognition through the app. And I think it might save the Boy Scouts because yeah. I, I think that it is something that is struggling. So. Yeah. Well, in, in this film, Fred McMurray comes to the town and he like it's, basically ran, wrangles all the boys together and see? gets the troop going mm -hmm. and, and stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's that, you know, helping kids and him going through and helping himself and he grows in the process, they grow in the process. It's really cool. Oh. And so it's, it's an important, I, I like the values of the Boy Scouts and the Cub Scouts and the things that, that you accomplish. And mm -hmm. so even if it were an app, I think it would be oh, really Oh, the Merit good. Badge program is phenomenal. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. Steven Spielberg, I went to the 1989 uh, National Jamboree for the Boy Scouts of America, yeah. where Steven Spielberg uh, was there and launched the cinematography Merit Badge. Um, and he is an Eagle Scout. I mean... That's a cool merit badge. Mm -hmm. I, I'm pretty sure both our boys did that merit badge. Yeah, I, yeah. they did because we had Max and stuff. Yeah. So for sure. So cool. Yeah. But also in 1966, Boy's Life did have a teaser article for the film yeah. Follow Me Boys. So, I mean, they were very excited and it was definitely promote, they were promoting each other. Mm -hmm. It was really And it was the sweet. heyday of Boy Scouts of America. Yeah. In the country. Sure. For sure, I'm sure. Yeah. Absolutely. So this was Kurt Russell's first film. Just okay. First credited he, screen time. Like, But I believe he was a Mickey Mouse Club member as well. Right. Yeah. But this was the first big credit Feature film. So, for his Disney appearance. Nice. So, yeah, really cool. Have you guys seen Follow Me Boys? If you haven't, uh, it is on Disney Plus. Yeah. Last I checked. <laughs> Which is so great because it. it's usually a later release in the cycle from like DVD to Blu-ray and some of this. Yeah. So it's nice they brought it out right away. But it's, you know, like it was released December 1st. So go watch it while you're enjoying your Christmas holidays and all that fun. And I hope you enjoy it. Tell us in the comments if you have seen it and if you like this video. Also, um, you know, we would love it if you would subscribe. And <laughs> we are so grateful when you guys leave comments. So we love all your comments. Yeah. and thank you so much we try to keep up even when we're in the parks <laughs> it's hard sometimes yeah. i feel so bad guys but um every single comment means a lot to us so we appreciate it so much you're wonderful people so thank, thank you very you. much